In today's News 9 Kitchen, we're making meatloaf with a twist. And to help me do this, I have Helen from Two Home Cooks. Hello. Hello to you. Nice to see you. Good seeing you. Thank you for having me. Who doesn't love bacon? Everybody. And meatloaf. And meatloaf. I mean, come on. Yes, it's, okay. it's two big partners. <laughs> it's wonderful. Yes. Um, so today we're making meatloaf. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to make individual meatloaf. Okay. Um, you know, you can have it, make it in a pan or a big loaf pan, a bread pan or something like that. Mm -hmm. But today uh, we, we're just going to put a little bit of twist to it. Okay. So we're going to just start ourselves out with um, some ground beef. Um, and then uh, basically I like onions in my ground Me too. in my meatloaf mm -hmm. and then some all seasoned breadcrumbs we throw that in and we're going to throw in some more bacon more, more bacon, bacon. Uh, so this is just chopped up bacon we call it bacon bits you okay. just throw that in mm -hmm. Um, I like to put an egg in for some more moisture yep. to hold it yep. all together. Mm -hmm. And then um, I like to add maybe, you know, a little bit of water to it. Not too much. That was um, really little. Yeah, yeah it's just mm -hmm. really little. So basically we want to get in there and, you know, get it all together. Um, I like to take like a cookie cutter. Okay. And then uh, we put it, you know, just get it all in there, mash it all in there to make it something like a pretty individual little meatloaf. Mm -hmm. um, today I'm putting it on a frying pan. Um, just to give you an example of what's going to come out of the oven. Mm -hmm. You're going to put these in the oven, uh, probably like about maybe like 350, 375 okay. in the oven. Um, but first, before you put them in the oven, you're going to wrap it up with thick um, bacon. So you're just going to wrap this up. Uh, if you if it doesn't stay together, you can put like a toothpick or something like that, just to basically so they can all. Now, Helen, was the bacon pre-cooked before you put it in the? Yeah, you yep. want to pre-cook it a little bit. Uh, you want the thick-cut bacon, so you want to pre-cook it on a on a sheet pan. Okay. Um, so that way, uh, some of the grease and stuff like that can come out sure. off of it. Mm -hmm. So today, I just showed you um, as we're warming up today. These are the individual. Um, bacon I love it uh, meatloaf that we have that we got going on looks so great. you want to take it mm -hmm. I did a little dish over here which is our mashed potatoes okay so it's just another good hearty meal and then you just want to lay them on top just like so um, I do have some some brown gravy you just want to pour some of that right on top perfect and wow wow Yes. Our staff is drooling right now. Yes. And just remind people at home where you guys are located. We are located in Dover. Mm -hmm. uh, it's 40 Chestnut Street. Uh, it's basically our hours are 730 to 2, okay. Tuesday through Friday, and Saturday and Sunday from 8 to 2. Perfect. So. And it's just meals like this, all homemade? All homemade. We serve breakfast and lunch all, t all day. So if you want to come in at 8 o'clock in the morning and have lunch, something like that, you can if you oh, wish. Oh, yeah. I like that. Yep, yep. Awesome. Which is really nice. Perfect, Helen. Thank you so much for making this meatloaf with us today. Yeah, thank you. We'll be right back.